Well, hello there, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. So in today's episode, we're going to be doing some more building, hopefully. Either on the main base or on the western town, I'm not sure yet. And I want to introduce you guys to our newest addition to the team. So I've been breeding like crazy. As you guys can see, i got a got a few mutations on it. It looks really cool. Uh, don't really have a name for it though. But yeah, I got some uh, got some pretty crazy stats. Well, at least for what I had to deal with. So I did level up uh, a couple times already, uh, mainly in weight a couple times. But yeah, the base stats were 41 weight, and 45 uh, melee damage, which is pretty good. Uh, I did get a little bit uh, less on the stamina because I ran out of patience for breeding, to be honest. <laughs> but we got a decent amount of health too. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I might end up breeding a little bit more, but for now this will do. Actually, I probably won't since I'm gonna build on this thing. So you'll we'll probably end up building on this thing later on in this episode too. But before we do that, uh, it's been a minute since I logged, since I last logged into the server. So I want to go check on the. Uh, let's get rid of this stuff real quick. I want to go check on the area where the Tyler spawn. See if we have any new, hopefully a new Tyler we can tame. <laughs> And that also gives me a chance to uh, get the guys caught up on what's been happening uh, the last couple days. Uh, since it's pretty frustrating. <laughs> but I bet you guys don't mind a little bit of story time, so let's get do that real quick. Alright, let's see. We need to go to the east. Or is it west? No, that's east. <laughs> uh, I think the sound is actually a little bit low. Let me double check. Uh, sound, sound, sound. There we go. Yeah, Ark is a little bit on the low side. There we go, that should do. Hopefully. <laughs> so yeah, uh, as you guys may or may not have noticed, I uploaded a uh, new video for Baldur's Gate. Actually ended up being two videos. Uh, some of you may have noticed it. Probably got a, like, a notification or something. But yeah, the first time I tried to record uh, Baldur's Gate, it uh, something went wrong, like I uploaded the video, I thought everything was cool, and then I got a phone call from a buddy of mine, and he said like the screen was flickering, so I double checked and I was really hoping it wasn't the case, but for some reason uh, on my end the screen was flickering as well, and I imagine for you guys it must have been too. So yeah, that was gonna be a big issue, because I don't wanna end up giving somebody uh, an epileptic uh, attack <laughs> or something. So yeah, I had to take it down and uh, re-record it. And it turns out uh, in OBS uh, my video encoder was was like really old or broken because when I tried to switch it, it just disappeared. So I had to try adding some new video encoders and they ended up not working. Like the video started lagging after like uh, two minutes. So yeah, for the past two days I've been working on it and trying to fix it and nothing seemed to be working. So I ended up switching to a new video encoder called HE something. Uh, I have it here somewhere. <laughs> yeah, it's called H.265, which is apparently something a lot of people recommend using. And it actually, uh, it, it brings you, uh, it makes the video quite smooth actually and, uh, and pretty high quality. So I ended up recording another episode of uh, Baldur's Gate and uh, when I put it in my video editing software, which is uh, DaVinci Resolve, if you guys are curious, it ended up uh, getting corrupted, so I thought what the heck was happening, so so yeah, a lot of back and forth and a lot of trouble and uh, ended up having to install a, no, I ended up having to buy a uh, little extension, which converts all the, uh, the video encoders to make it... Uh, Make it workable with the uh, DaVinci Resolve. So yeah, that's pretty much a short, uh, short version of it. <laughs> but yeah, in between that, a lot of frustrations and a lot of anger and rage and <laughs> sadness. Yeah, for a moment there, I thought I was gonna have to take a break from video recording till I have this issue resolved. And in the worst case, I had, uh, had to eventually buy a new video card because. I know my thing is ancient, but I can't really afford a new video card right now, so that was going to be a big issue. And I want to be able to provide uh, the smoothest quality for you guys. 
like if I was gonna record on my previous uh, video encoder, the footage when I'm when I'm moving will be very pixelated, and I hate to provide uh, such bad quality, since I've been, I think I've been uh, putting out some decent quality videos. So if I would be going back to some some bad quality, I would have been pretty sad. <laughs> So yeah, I would, I would prefer not to upload any videos instead of uh, uploading bad quality. Yeah, in the... Ah, jeez. Stupid micro -routers. Uh, Jane. Thank you. Can you help me? Please? Oh my god, I do like no damage to these things. You broke my stuff. Rude. Oh, no you don't. You don't just get to pretend you didn't do anything to me. You. I see you. Uh-oh. I'm sorry. Holy crap. Now I'm naked. <laughs> Dang it. Yeah, the Tylers should be around over here somewhere. Usually I see them around this area. Oh, hello. Oh, you're level 12. So yeah, anyway, from what I've seen, uh, the video quality for this, with this video encoder, should be pretty good. Uh, if not, I can still end up changing it a little bit. I bumped it up, up as high as I could. I can even increase the video bitrate, which is usually something you don't want to touch because it can lead to a lot of issues. <laughs> At least in my experience. But yeah, there's one silver lining to this, to all of this. I've learned new things, at least. You know, from every bad experience, you can always learn something from it, so at least that is something. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully I won't have to worry about any uh, video troubles for a while anymore. Oh, hi. How you doing? Level 48. I need to find a high level uh, from Kotlin here pretty soon. Would be cool to tame one of those. Alright, let's see here. Uh, we're gonna explore this little plateau a little bit and if can't find anything, then we'll... Uh, We'll just move on. What do we got? Uh, shield, don't really need that. I think I already got a shield. Yeah. Let's throw it away so I don't uh, come back here in like two minutes. Because uh, sometimes I have uh, a bit of a short term memory. <laughs> so, yeah, one last thing. Please uh, give me any feedback if you guys notice any difference or if the video quality does end up uh, sucking. I'm hoping it's not, but still, I would love some feedback, of course. Come on, give me a high level. I will take anything above 160. <laughs> I know at first I was gonna prefer 180, but if I can get a female that is uh, at least above 160, then I'll be pretty happy. So then I can breed them up and uh, still end up with a really good one. Uh, it's a saber. Don't really care. Hey, you got a weapon there. I'm overheating as well. Oh, it's yes, because I don't have any clothes on. <laughs> It's fine. Figure it out. Level 18. I know there's a couple that spawn up there in the north too. Oh uh oh. Run. Don't poop. Oh my god. Oh, don't hit me. Okay, you hit me. <laughs> oh, this is not good. Let's uh, bring out the old shoddy. There we go. Oh wow. <laughs> I forgot how strong this shoddy is. Ooh, that could have gone pretty bad. Good thing I didn't panic. <laughs> Level 6. Oh, come on. Come on, give me a 180. No, you want to. Come on, high levels. Where are you? Oh, hey, it's my old trap. <laughs> Is that a Tyler? No. Not a rock golem. Jeez. Wait, did I go for a circle? I did. Alright, fair enough. I guess we'll move on from here. Sometimes there's animals up top here. I wonder. Should we go have a look? I think I got my grappling hook up in here, right? Yeah. Yeah, let's go take a quick peek and if uh, we can't find anything, then we'll just move on. And jump. So it's quite fun, actually. <laughs> you. Come on, reach. Oh, my goodness. Eee. I don't know if you guys ever played Atlas, but uh, in Atlas you have this uh, similar grappling hook, but it allows you to swing and stuff, which is pretty fun. Uh, it's pretty bad for climbing, but 
anything else it's uh it's quite enjoyable uh looks like this time around there's nothing up here fair enough maybe over there i just pooped ah uh, yeah so i'm gonna head back to base and now uh meet you guys over there All right, so scratch that idea. Uh, I forgot to look down here, uh, which is like on the other side here. <laughs> don't know why I'm such, having such trouble explaining, but look at over there. Oh, he just disappeared. Got a 174. Uh, it's got some really bad stats to be honest, but I think I will take it anyway. Uh, let's see, uh, we need to eat real quick. Don't know why I hopped off, I didn't need to. So, how many kibble do you need? You need... Excuse me. Rude. So you need two extraordinary kibble. Let's see if we can make that. Uh, we gotta remember those coordinates. So, 54, 85. Probably should take a screenshot. There we go. So yeah, it looks like my luck is finally turning around, which is pretty awesome. Quite happy with that. <laughs> I kind of needed a win for today, because uh, after all the frustration and stuff, eh, on my way. There we go, tame up this guy real quick, uh, or go. And then we can uh, go ahead and, um, we can go ahead and do some more building. So let me fly back and forth real quick, and then I'll uh, bring you guys back once I'm back here again with some kibble and uh, all the goodies that I need to tame up this, uh, this girl. I'll be here back. Alright, so got a little bit of an issue here. Um, for extraordinary cable we need giant bee honey and that is something that I currently do not have. So that kind of sucks. Um, I don't even know how to get bee honey in, uh, in Scorched Earth. I don't remember ever seeing a bee beehive in this, uh, well anywhere in this area. So that's a bit of an issue. Let me uh, do a quick Google search actually. Just in case, uh, scorched earth, bee honey. Of course, it's freaking ten minute video. CD and oil veins, salt, silica pearls, red flowers, bee honey. But the people always have to drag out things like this. <laughs> oh, hold on. Okay, so apparently we can find some beehives uh, pretty close to here, actually. So, 55, 54, he said. Can I zoom in on my map? There we go. 55, 54, which is this way. It's on this side or that side? Let's see. Let's try this side. Out of my way. I'm in a hurry. <laughs> 55, so we need to go pure this way. Okay, so we have to be on the other side. That's okay, though. Should be able to go around here in a little bit. Uh, somewhere. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Let's get him up a little bit. It seems to be getting a little bit dark. So we need to go back on this side. Yeah. Somewhere around here should be the entrance to the uh, caverns. Or trenches, whatever you want to call them. 55, 50... Oh, 51. That works. Right, so apparently in here you can find a few of them. Oh, it's really dark in here. Do we have a torch? Uh, I do. Look at me thinking of everything. <laughs> and if there are any beehives in here, our spyglass should pick it up. Let's keep an eye on up above us. I think one of the artifact caves is in here too. Oh, hey, is that one? I believe it is. Sweet. I wish we had a bear though, but we do not. That's okay. I think we're just gonna grab it real quick. Eh. Get up there. And I guess we can come back later here to uh, to grab up some more if we can. Oh, run. Oh, oh, sorry. Jane, please. Oh, why did I get dismounted? Excuse me. Please don't do that. <laughs> These bees are terrifying, man. <laughs> Alright, amazing.
All right, we're back. So I uh, cooked up some uh, kibble. Got two of them, which is exactly what we need, I think. And uh, before we go, I wanted to show you guys something that I kind of forgot about. So I set up a bunch of these planters. I'm not sure if I uh, mentioned uh, I was going to go download. Uh, I mean, put in a, uh, a mod for uh, farming up mushrooms and rare flowers. But I ended up uh, putting it in the server and it works like a charm. Actually, I can just show you guys like this. Uh, see, rare flowers. So yeah, there's a bunch of them in there. Already got a thousand in the refrigerator. So we got three of each set up and they're, they're working really well. They're actually working a lot better than uh, than these things. For some reason they don't really go higher than this amount or at least a little bit higher. I'm not sure what's up with that. Usually I end up having tons of uh, re uh, crops from this, but somehow uh, there seems to be a limit on them, um, how many they can uh, grow at a time. So that's kind of odd. But I don't mind ever coming over every once in a while and uh, clean up this mess. So it's not too bad. Alright, let's head on over to the Tyler and uh, I'll meet you guys over there. Alright, here we are. Let's go get rid of uh, all these strats here. If we can find a nice flat spot, we can uh, set up the trap a little bit easier. Yeah, I think this will do. It's a good amount of distance. Go. Are you on passive still? No, you're not. Here we go. So we're just gonna use the same trap that we usually make. It's pretty simple and straightforward. Just the way I like it. Here we go. Oh, oops. Can I have that back, please? Yeah, thank you very much. Alright, so I think we're just gonna do this on foot. So let's see if we can get its attention. Of course. Why do you have to walk away? Show me your face. There we go. Jump shot. Sweet. Oh, got a one. Got a one. Go, 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 go. Ooh. Ow. She got a nibble on me. That's okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I brought uh, John Wayne with me so I can uh, compare the stats uh, very easily. Oh, you are beautiful. Holy crap. Look at those colors. I like you. Hopefully, we can get your colors in the, in the baby. Sorry about that, didn't realize I have my phone on loud still. Here we go. Am I getting headshots? Yeah, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> Wait, that was straight in your face and didn't give me a headshot? There you go, go get some sleepies. With all those uh, darts in your face. <laughs> Alright, so two kibbles should do. Yeah, your health is really bad. See, 16 compared to 45, so we're good on that. Uh. Your melee is decent, 37, that's pretty good. So we want your melee stat and John Wayne's health. And besides that, I don't really care for anything. Uh, weight is pretty good. There's a lot of points in movement speed, which is kind of kind of sucks, but that's okay. We'll make do. Let's see how long you need to tame uh, Toto Dex. I need to get the app on my phone. <laughs> I don't have a second monitor, so all tabbing is a bit annoying. Here we go. Got a 174, perfect. You take about six, mi six minutes. That is good. Any other goodies around? Alrighty then. So what are John Wayne's colors again? Let's see here. Let's see if we can compare them. Are you like reddish? Slash uh, all the other stuff. Pretty cool. Yeah, I really like this grayish slash black color with the white underneath. Ah, it's amazing. A little bit of a green there as well. That is interesting. Do you have the same thing? No, you do not. You got a bit of orange though, so that's cool. Alright, pretty cool, pretty cool. Pretty soon here I want to start looking for a Uranus. Uranus. I prefer to call it Uranus because it just sounds funnier. And I think we were gonna go for Carnos. I think I mentioned last episode, right? Yeah. So we gotta find a high level Carno as well. Unless you can. After. Oh, oh my, holy crap, what the heck? Where did Freak the Jill come from? Oh, please don't tell me you damaged him. Okay, still 100%. Ow! 
Stop throwing rocks. That's so rude. <laughs> We're gonna have to lead you away from this guy. You're just gonna burrow, burrow there. And they blend in so well. <laughs> Ooh, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Jeez. So you're still 100% right? Yeah. Okay. We're cool. We're fine. Everything is good. Stupid Arto. Arto Plura. 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 Whatever they're called. Hey. Wake up. Got babies to make. <laughs> ah, I'm excited to finally get to ride on a Tyler again. Although next episode we're probably gonna end up uh, going for our first cave. That would be cool. Is that a high level car now? Oh, 54. Yeah. Oh, you broke one of my ramps. It's annoying. Probably some of the trap got damaged as well. It's a good thing I didn't remove it. That's holy crap. It managed to shield it from... Uh, See what the Tyler from the rock at least. Oh no! <laughs> Somehow I already forgot about this thing. <laughs> Please don't attack my trap. I will not appreciate that. Stop it with the rocks, dude. No. No, you don't. Oh no. Oh, are you serious? Ah, crap. Dang it. Oh, that's so annoying. Uh, look at the taming effectiveness. Uh, what do I do? I mean, I can let her wake up. Yeah, we might have to do that. Ah, I hate you! Die! What at? Yeah, let's take the kid while real quick. Before it tames up. Please don't die. Okay, there we go. It's borrowed. Oh my god. Well, guess we're gonna have to come back later. Yeah, we're gonna have to let her wake up. Son of a bee. Alright, I guess we'll go back to base and uh, go work on some building then. Oh, that's so frustrating. <laughs> well, I guess I, it was my fault. I was being stupid. Alright, I guess I'll meet you guys back at base. <laughs> Alright, we're back at base over here. So while the Taylor's waking up, uh, I want to go check out uh, these facade thingies. Let's put down the crafting table. I did uh, end up making a mind type tonic in between episodes, so I got that covered already. Uh, let's see here, so there's a couple western facades. There's uh, one Victorian as well, which we could potentially use as well. Not sure, and there's a medieval one too, but we're probably not going to be able to use that. But I do want to go check it out real quick, so let's uh, let's do this one. There we go. Check out the Victorian too. And I want to make all the western facades. And number two. Oh my god, it's so confusing. Uh, you know what, let's uh, pull in some wood, fiber, and uh, let's see here, 5,000. So I'm pretty sure I just need... Why can I not see the requirements for it? There we go. A touch and fiber. Definitely got that. Uh, I think I'm a little bit low on fiber. Not a whole lot, but a little bit. So we'll do like 2000 from that. It should be more than enough. Right, number three, uh, four, and corner. All right, fair enough. This one needs stone. Okay. I'll make two of the twos. <laughs> That's fine. There's the Victorian one. So what I'm wondering is if you can build uh, up against them. Because I'm pretty sure facade means uh, that it's just a singular wall. It's a snap point. Seriously? Uh, I guess I can make a couple foundations. That is what it needs. Uh, oh, here we go. Got a couple here. Should be enough. Here we go, let's just place four of these and we can just use them over. Alright, let's start with number one. Oh, that's not number one. There we go. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, can I rotate it somehow? Is it backwards? It is. That is really cool though. I uh, don't like the way it snaps against the foundations though. That's kind of weird. 
pick up? Oh my god, you take forever. Can I pick it up with the gun? Nope. <laughs> Dang it. Three hours later. And boop. Oh, come on. <laughs> Dang it. Yay, there we go. Alright, so how do we properly snap you? Hmm. Oh, I guess like that. Yeah, that works. Hey, there we go. Awesome. Okay, so technically you just need one foundation. That is good to know. And then I imagine we can just build onto it. Yeah, that is cool. I'm not sure how much of use it's gonna be since, uh, yeah, that could be a problem. Let's see, because you want to be, because if you want to build behind it, it might look a little bit weird. I definitely like the way it looks though, but yeah, I might not be able to use it as much as I'd like to. Just put a couple of foundations here. There we go, that way we can take a look at all of them. Excuse me. Oh, hello. Get out of here. Alright, and uh, number two. Where's number two? I never made number two. What the heck? Are you number two? No, you're one. Where did number two go? <laughs> Or is it one giant building? That could be the case too. No, definitely not. Kind of looks like a little bit like uh, the Atlas stuff. Yeah, a little bit higher quality though. Which is pretty cool. Alright, see if we can snap this one right as well. There we go. Yeah, it's a little smaller building. That's cool. Uh, what about the next one? Number three. Snapping them is a little bit awkward. There we go. Oh, I like that one. That is cool. Number four. All right, pretty similar to the other ones, but that's okay. In a corner. Uh, let's see here. Ooh. Pretty cool. Not a fan of the connecting doors here, though. That's kind of a weird design, but that's okay. All right, let's check out the Victorian one. Uh, which we can just plop down over here. There we go. Ooh, wow. That is nice. Yeah, this is something we can definitely not use. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure. Hmm. I mean, I really want to use these, but... I kind of want to make actual buildings and not... Well, facades. <laughs> Yeah, really cool, but I don't think I'm gonna use it, sadly. Unless I can... I mean, I can try and make it work. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do some testing in between episodes, because I... I'm kind of lost on how to actually work it out here, so... I'm gonna have to do some brainstorming. Alright, so... What else do we got? Oh yeah, I was gonna work on this thing. Um, I need to find the platform saddle thingy again. The uh, little extension for it. Did I lose it somewhere? Uh, I may have. <laughs> yeah, I think I accidentally put it in the other guy's inventory. And when I picked it up with the soul gun, of course, uh, the inventory disappeared. So, that's an issue unless it's in here. Oh, it is. Hey. Thank you, uh, past me. <laughs> right, let's see. So, if we do build on this, what kind of uh, design will we want? I mean, I know I had a design last time in my head, but I kind of forgot about it. Uh, let's see, let's grab a couple walls. And then we can see what kind of stuff we're dealing with. Uh, we're probably gonna end up grabbing a couple of these. Uh, oh yeah, did I make some more clay by chance? I did. Ah, oh, amazing. Yeah, I got that up some sap earlier, but I didn't remember if I actually ended up crafting it. Uh, let's drop these, there we go. Little trick there if you guys didn't know. <laughs> so can we get that ceiling still? That is the question. Uh, here's a couple walls and stuff. Let's just mess around with a couple things here. Okay, so we can attach more ceilings if we want to. And it's a 3 by 3 looks like. Plus these of course. I mean, do we really want to make it this big? Probably not. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the way that looks. Alright, fair enough. So I think what I want is something... 
I definitely want to keep the site open. And then in the back, maybe we can attach a ladder, perhaps. Or we can, ooh, we can make some triangle ceilings. Uh, do I have some by chance? No, I don't. Uh, triangle, let's do like six or eight of them. I think it's six. Just do eight, just in case. Yeah, I don't really need a ladder, actually, now I think about it. Oh, it was five. <laughs> Yeah, I do want this little extension over here. Probably not in here. Or do I? Oh, we can't even, so that's okay. Why do these things look weird? They look darker than usual. Yeah, this might be a little bit more difficult than I thought. There we go, we can have a little chill area here. Uh, we could put some windows there. That could work. We can still ride it. Yeah, hello. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Oh, oh don't, 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 don't move. <laughs> yeah, I think I kind of like the look of that. Yeah, we'll make that work. Uh, we'll check on it later though. I think it's been enough time passed since... Uh, so let's go check on the Tyler again. Uh, we need one more kibble then. So we need three paste. All right, there we go. Uh, one last wrist chowder. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Just one, please. Amazing. Alright, let's put that in there. There we go. And let's hope it woke up by the time we got there. I like how I always plan a lot more stuff and I end up doing the exact opposite of what I plan to. <laughs> like I mentioned, I was gonna build this episode, but it doesn't seem like it might be possible this episode. That's okay though. Oh, turn down the brightness a little bit. Was kind of blinding. All right, here we are again. So for some reason the tile is still in there. That is amazing. And let's hope the uh, taming effectiveness reset. I'm not sure if that's the way it works, but I'm pretty sure it does. There we go. It's getting knocked out again. After this uh, girl's knocked out, I got a little surprise for you guys that I. Uh, <laughs> Thought, uh, thought about before I left the uh, the base here uh, a couple minutes ago. So let's get you knocked out. Uh, one more should do, I believe. Especially a headshot. Yep. Awesome. Alright, so I'm pretty sure now if we put the food in. Oh yeah, there we go. Sweet. She's all tamed up as well. Awesome. Alright, so let's take a look at your tamed stats. So... Oh yeah, I got tons of melee damage, uh, low on health, pretty decent stamina and weight actually, so that's good. And you know what, that ain't too bad, I like it, especially the colors. Oh crap, I think I actually spoiled, uh, yeah, <laughs> so I bought some rocket launchers for some uh, ultimate revenge. Because this, uh, this rock column pissed me off, so I want to take care of it. Actually, let's put both of these in the hot bar. Because I know they break pretty quickly. <laughs> Can you imagine if we actually end up taming this thing? That would have been hilarious too. Yeah, I don't have the resource to make the kibble, so screw it. Um, let's get some high ground. There we go. Jane can stay over there for a little bit. Actually, we should probably pick her up. Yeah, let's do that real quick. <laughs> Hi, Scorpion. Yeah, yeah. So I'm hoping I brought enough rockets, or rocket launchers as well. <laughs> it's time to get some revenge. Let's see, hopefully I can find some epic music to play in the background too. <laughs> Probably not. I've been uh, having some trouble finding some good music to uh, play in the background for you guys. Go. Bring it on, sucker. Oh, do your rock throwing. And... Let's get a hit. Awesome. Die. I actually got some torpor there. Wow. Did I actually find a nice taming threat? <laughs> if I had a catapult up here, I would have been able to tame it actually. But you are gonna die, sir. Oh man. I guess you are everything. <laughs> die. Ow. Yeah, 
Yes. Correct. Uh oh. We're still fine. Oh my god. Okay, we're not fine. Please go up. <laughs> oh goodness. Almost killed myself. Boom. Oh, this is so satisfying. <laughs> Love it. Correct it, stupid column. Elemental. Oh. What more should do? Boom. Revenge. <laughs> yes. Get freaking wrecked. By that. <laughs> oh, that feels good. Naked again, but it feels amazing. <laughs> Alright, let's head on back to the base and uh, see if we can figure out some, some building. Alright, we're back at base and we got... Uh, John Wayne and the new Tyler cleaning up uh, for a little bit. So we're gonna do some other stuff while they uh, do that thing and uh, we'll check on the chair in a little bit. So I think what I would like to do is go uh, go ahead and go jump on, jump into a quick building time lapse and go build up uh, the base on the para Paraceratarium. I got kind of an idea of, of, uh, of what I wanna go, to, uh, go with. So yeah, let's uh, jump straight into it, shall we? Alright, here we are. I know it ain't much, but it's functional at least, and that's the most important part. I mean, I don't have to build a mansion on top of this thing. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I might add a few additions here and there. I'm tempted to try out the uh, some plants on top of this. That might look pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna decorate it. I'm gonna add a few workstations here, so I can work on that. Uh, did it add a lot to the weight? No, it didn't, so that's good. I yeah, got a little ladder here. We'll probably end up putting a bed here and some other stuff. And down here is gonna be a couple crafting stations. Up here, probably attempted to do a second floor, but for now, this will do. So, yeah, I'm sorry uh, things didn't really go as planned for today, but that's usually how it goes. <laughs> uh, I think next episode, we're definitely gonna do some more building. But for now, um, I don't think I have a lot of time left for this episode, so we don't think we can squeeze in more building for right for today or anything else. Uh, let's go check on the babies actually real quick. How you guys doing? Any babies? Oh, we got tons. Let's see any good ones? That one is terrible. <laughs> also terrible. Ooh, got a melee bonus, but all the other stuff, I'm not sure if I can actually work with that. I'll put you on the side for right now, though. Ooh, we got a pink mutation. Curious about that. Uh, minus four in food, so that's something. Uh, anything else? Doesn't look like it. Right, let's get rid of these. So you are... Where's the mutation one? This one. It's got horrible stats. But... Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's so pink. That's crazy. <laughs> I love that. I think the uh, wolf was pretty pink as well, right? Let's take a look real quick. Yeah, 
I've got a lot of pink mutations lately. Oh, looks like my uh, item collector has ran out of juice. Yeah, I did. That's fine though. I'll make up some more juice before uh, before I lock off today. Uh, let's see here. Uh, there was one that just came in there. Uh, not a horrible one. That's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna put these on the side for now. Um, yeah, I might end up working with this one. You know, definitely don't mind uh, any food uh, going down. So, hmm. yeah, let's just put you in here for right now. <laughs> You're just gorgeous. You're gonna be a nice addition to the base. <laughs> I mean, pink is not really my color, but I can uh, I can appreciate any color. So it's fine. Uh, you can be destroyed. So yeah, not a whole lot of luck in that department, but oh, hey, I think we got twins. We did. And they're both terrible. Dang it. <laughs> That's fine. Eventually we get the we get a good one, right? Right, what do you mean? Yes. Alright, so it ended up being uh, a pretty successful episode. I'm glad everything uh, went well eventually. <laughs> Things went quite wrong in the beginning, of course, but we made it work. And next episode, we're definitely gonna be doing some more building. I promise this time. <laughs> So yeah, I think I'm gonna call this video here today guys, so if you end up enjoying the video, please leave a like and comment if you want. And also if you're new here and you wanna see more, make sure to subscribe. Alright, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!